okay. this was all about the users now we'll talk about groups so why we need groups uh, think of as a uh, software company a web development company so mainly it has two groups uh, one is front-end developer and one is back-end developers so you don't want to mess with each other files so create two groups and give um, everyone uh, different privileges so if uh, the, uh, the front end one uh, front end developers don't don't need to look at the database files so they don't uh, need to have the access over database files so for giving restriction we need uh, groups okay so how to add a group the company uh, the command is simple sudo super user do group add and the group name let's take front end okay the group oh, I have already created that one so just let's add boys and girls right boys okay I have added one group so let's add a user to the group uh, we have user available also let's create another user as using command sudo user add Prabha, then let's type the punker. Okay, we have added a user. Let's add the punker to the group boys. Okay, the command is simple. Let's clear this one first. The command is sudo add user to group sudo g password g p a s s w d minus a for appending user user means uh, let's let's set the bunker to the group name boys so see adding user the bunker to group boys okay so we can remove the user from group using uh, sudo let's remove the bunker from group sudo g p s s w d minus d for removing you know deleting user name is the punker and the group name is boys see removing user the punker from boys okay so let's add again the punker so that you can perform other things so we we can uh, rename a group the command is simple sudo group modifier g r o u p m o d minus n new group name let's take m e n instead of boys and the old group, group name is boys okay so uh, how to see whether whether this this is modified or not let's list all the groups the command is simple S -S -U -D -O -C -A -T, cat, etc uh, group what it does it inside it is a directory it will just read the file group where all the configuration all the details are written if we can do that use uh, for users also I'll tell all the directory ranking of the Unix and all the directory structure in another video. Okay, so we don't need you don't need to worry about this. We'll deal about that later. Okay, see, this is a group. This is a user. These are Amit, Abhay. This is also a group. This is also a group. I've already created these things. You know. Okay, let's clear. okay so we have listed all the users in a, uh, we have rena renamed the groups and okay we can do this group members and thing the command is simple sudo means like the bunker exists uh, belongs to which groups zroups groups username is the bunker see 
the punker belongs to two groups the punker and man when we create a new user a uh, by default a, a new group is created with the same name of the user so the punker belongs to these two groups the punker and the man we have uh, I assigned this group uh, assigned the punker to this group okay so we can delete a group also the command is sudo zero up group delete then the group name group name is let's man now we can let's list the groups what are the command sudo cat tc group see man group is not there so this was all about the root and the normal use